gods, nothing but the blood, neither by the blood of goats and calves, but by his own blood he entered into the holy place, having obtained eternal redemption for us. Hebrews 9.12 Jesus Christ came for one reason, to take away the sin of the world. He shed his blood on Calvary, not so we could have a new house, new car, nice clothes. He bled and died to take away our sin. Sin is what crucified our Savior and is what will cripple our walk with him. J.G. Pike was known for his godly counsel to young disciples. He wrote this about sin. Sin is unspeakable, hateful, and loathsome because it is committed against God. It offends the blessed majesty of heaven, insults the Father, wounds the Son, and grieves the Spirit. Sin is so vile that it can never be pardoned or washed away but by the blood of the Son of God. Should all creatures of the earth and all angels of heaven have offered themselves as a sacrifice to divine justice, all could not have expatiated one sin or atoned for one transgression? Or had the Son of God himself sought man's happiness by supplication only, there is no reason for supposing he could have been heard. He must suffer, or man eternally must die. We should be filled with eternal abhorrence of that which murdered Jesus on Calvary, and which, but for his death, would have murdered our soul with everlasting destruction. Ask God to give you a hatred for your sin. Remember, it was sin that crucified our Savior, and it is sin that will cripple you. This devotional was taken from Daily Awakenings by the Reverend Steve Hill, and I pray you have a blessed day.